FX scan. And in this video, I'm gonna show you the steps to importing a digital impression overlay into your uh, T-Scan software. So first thing you wanna do is you wanna be able to locate where those STLs or TTL files are located. So let me repeat, you wanna find the STL or the TTL files. You may need to contact your uh, digital scanner rep to figure out where to locate those files. And then you want to save those to a location that's easily accessible for the T-Scan system. The second thing you want to do is you want to locate the patient that you want to import those patients for. So in this case, we're just going to use a demo patient and then we're going to click edit patient. So you can see down here at the bottom here where it says upper digital impression, lower digital impression. This is where you're going to import your um, digital impression overlays into your T-Scan. So we're going to click browse and then we're going to locate those files. So in this case, we're looking here at the digital impression files. Let's do demo patient five. And in this case, the upper is called opposing. Um, the upper or lower may be called different things depending on which uh, system you're using. So I click on opposing. And then I'm gonna do the same thing for lower digital impression. In this case, I'm gonna click on prep. Once you locate the files, you can now hit save. And then T-Scan is gonna go through its process to uh, minimize the size of the file. So all you're gonna do here is click yes. I let T-Scan go through this process. So that's how simple it is to import your digital impression overlays. Once you, once it's finished this process, you can either record a new scan or go to an existing uh, recording, open it up. And then the way you um, bring your digital impression overlays into your T-Scan software is you click on the digital impression uh, tab up here. And then that will bring in your digital impression um, into your T-Scan system. So I hope this helps. If you have any questions, let us know.